In today's WFIB video, I'm going to teach you how to fix a boat that capsizes, sinks, or is otherwise improperly balanced. Let's get right into it. Truth. Hello and welcome. So I'm sure we've all had this problem once or twice. You've just built a boat and you are super happy with it. The boat looks amazing and you've spent a whole lot of time perfecting your design. You finish with a little bit of extra armor and then you test it out on the water. Unfortunately, your boat decides that it's high time to sink. Oh no, what are we gonna do? Don't worry, I've got your back. First, let's start out with a bit of diagnostic testing. Determine in which way your boat is sinking or unbalanced. Is it drifting a bit to one side or the other? Does it sink as soon as the water comes? Maybe it tilts into the water a lot whenever you're steering. Whatever the issue, I'm going to help you with it. So if your ship is basically capsizing into the water in the direction of movement, it's definitely too heavy. You can try one of two things, removing some excess weight or compressing more wood all around your ship. Additionally, make sure that your seat isn't too high above the water as this can actually cause your ship to be literally pulled into the water at a surprising speed. Next, let's worry about drifting ships. This is most commonly caused by a simple imbalance either caused from uneven wind compression or uneven weight distribution. There are a few ways to fix this. The first one is to delete and recompress all of your wood. If you want to be as accurate as possible, make sure to use an auto clicker set to around 49 milliseconds for a great balance between click time and accuracy, link in the description. If this doesn't work, try putting your seat in the exact middle of your ship, and if that doesn't work, it's probably time for drastic measures and you might want to end up rebuilding the whole dang thing. One super common issue within WFAB is that a ship likes to flip. No matter the amount of compression of wood and saving of weight, it sometimes seems as if there's no way to save a boat that's too thin. Well, there actually is, and let me show you. All it requires is iron weights and steel trusses. Use the trusses and weights to form an underwater weight that significantly lowers the center of gravity of your ship, hopefully reducing any and all imbalances. Anyways, that is all for today's video. I hope you all liked it and learned how to fix your tilty ships in WV. Don't forget to use code SHOTUS at RedDragonShop.com. Have a great day. Bye-bye.